Have you ever wondered what powers the world's largest passenger jet? Today, we're diving into the heart of the Airbus A380. But in miniature, this isn't just a model. It's a working DIY assembly of the TR900 engine, complete with moving parts and turbine action. So let's unbox it, build it, and bring this beast to life. Right, time to see what we have in here. Okay, as we can see, there is our nozzle. I can see that straight away. As you can also see, it looks really neat and really clean. And it also does already have LED lights right on the inside there, right around the edges, which is amazing because we will not have to try and glue them in ourselves. And those LEDs will just enhance that visual experience, which is fantastic. When we come to this part right here, this is our actual base for the actual jet, because I can see a push rod right here, and this is how we're going to turn it on and off. And what's quite amazing is that this jet can go from zero to 300 RPM, and that is magical. And at the back of it, we can also see a port for Type-C USB cable that will recharge the battery that's right in here. Let's see what we've got in here. As we can see, here's our actual fan. And as you can see, it's really nice and shiny. I love the metallic color. As we can see, this is our cover for the actual fan. Again, really nice and shiny. Love the metallic color. Again, can't get over it because these parts are actually made out of PLA, yup. And if you don't know what PLA is, it's actually from renewable sources. And if you find that in the models, that is absolutely fantastic. Let's see what we got at the bottom of the box. And here's our casing for the compressor, combustor, and the actual turbine. And again, as you can see, it's really clean, really neat, and shiny. And if you didn't know already, all of these parts are precisely 3D printed, and that also adds an extra bonus. We do not need to lubricate anything. So it's basically a mess-free model, which is exactly what we need. And all of these other parts that we see right at the bottom here, just like these ones, will be for the compressor, combustor, and the actual turbine. And I don't know about yourselves, but... I absolutely love how everything's packaged. It, it is clean, very neat, and very professional. We've also got a little wee spinner right here for that fan. And, yep, it also came with a Type-C USB cable, which is absolutely awesome, so you do not have to go and look for your own. This kit also includes this really nice long screwdriver and tweezers. We've also got three bearings in the kit, and they are not PLA, they are actual metal parts. And overall, this kit only has 50 parts, so we should not take long at all to build, and it should be incredibly satisfying. And the kit, of course, came with assembly instructions, so as we can see, they are in English as well, which is exactly what I need, and as you can see, there are not many steps at all and then we're gonna end up with this absolute beast and just one last thing before i begin the build i just want to say a big thank you to eagle digi for sending me this incredible looking model and if you guys fancy anything like this or other metal models make sure you go on eagle digi website i've got a link in the comment section and the video description and make sure you use my promo code martens to save 10% on absolutely everything. And just to let you know, they do have a couple more engines on their website that look really quite awesome. So make sure you go and check them out. And let's begin.
And here we are, ladies and gents. Take a look at this A380 TR900 engine. This looks absolutely beautiful. I love that metallic color all over the place. And when I talk about the actual build, it was a breeze and so satisfying. And I'm not gonna lie, I think this is the quickest I have ever assembled any model. It literally took me 20 minutes to build. And when they say satisfying, yeah, it was very satisfying, especially when you popped all of these pieces in the place, so the low pressure turbine and the compression turbine. Those pieces, when they click in that place and just make that click sound, ah, oh, satisfaction. And just look all over it, look at those blades. That looks absolutely amazing. And I cannot wait to place it on that base and turn it on and watch it in action. And before I place it on the base, I really hope you guys have enjoyed this video. So please make sure you click that like button down below. It costs you nothing and it's majorly appreciated. And of course, make sure you subscribe down below on this side and make sure you go and check out Eagle Digi models. I have a link in the comment section and description. And remember, use my promo code Martens to save 10% on everything. And now I simply have to place our engine on the base just like so and use the push rod to push it up and turn it on. So let's watch it in action. This is absolutely brilliant and those red LED lights just make it look so much better. That is absolutely amazing. I absolutely love how easy it is to control the speed as well. That is absolutely awesome and again i so hope you've enjoyed this model make sure you go and check it out and other models eagle digi have and yes please leave a like that would be massively appreciated and thank you so much for watching everybody i shall see you all next time bye for now